Hello everyone, welcome back to Succulents by Vani. Today, I want to talk about string of pearls, I mean variegated string of pearls to be exact. But before that, I would like to ask you, if you are new to me, to please subscribe to my channel. And if you like the video, you can always give me a thumbs up. You can leave a nice comment down below. And of course, you can share this video to anyone who you think will like to watch it. Now, let's get started. Variegated string of pearls are one of the most beautiful succulents in my opinion. I'm sharing my unboxing video with you because I am very happy with my purchase. I was so excited to unbox it the other day when I received it. Personally, I really love string of pearls, especially when they are variegated like this. So the packaging is perfectly done, very neat and clean. And the plant itself is very healthy and looking beautiful. I would say they even look more beautiful than what they advertised. For me, the pricing is pretty decent because this plant is pretty rare. As you can see here, they are only $12.99 each. I bought two of them, so all in all cost me $35.42 US dollars. If you want to know where I bought this from, please leave me a comment so I can give you the name of the website. Now I want to show you how to repot this plant. First, you must have a pot or planter that has good drainage like this one. Next, the soil. Make sure, my friend, to use cactus soil with succulent because my soil is pretty old and very dry I'm going to add fertilizer mix them like this and this fertilizer really works three weeks ago I used it for my string of pearl and this is the picture before fertilizer after three weeks they all look like this growing faster and healthier look at the new pearls they are just sprouting out so quickly and beautifully now i'm preparing the soil for planting first i'm just digging holes like this and then take out the plant from its old planter slowly very slowly like this and then very carefully put them in the soil just like this you must do this very gently because the pearls and the strings or stems are fragile and easy to break now I'm doing the same thing with the second batch. Take it out and very slowly and carefully put them in the soil. Another thing you need to know is that to place the string or the stem close to the top soil. Why? Because from the stem will come out the roots so it needs to be on top of the soil common sense now watering because my soil is very dry i am going to water this good i am going to make sure the soil will be wet I do not even need to worry about overwatering this for the first time because well that's the purpose of the drainage holes the water eventually will run down but my friends as a reminder do not water again 
your plants or succulent until the top two inches of soil is completely dry this is very important so your plant is not going to die next this is really optional I'm just doing this so that my plant will look nice and neat I'm putting marbles but really in about two weeks I'm going to take the marbles out only because the plants are string of pearls like this they will grow and then they will just crawl all over the place and I want them to have space to crawling <laughs> next I'm sprinkling a little bit more fertilizer like this just to make sure my plants will have enough nutrition now if you want to put your plants indoor make sure they are going to be by the window and they'll get sunlight at least two hours a day when they're outdoor put them in a shade and they need to get direct sunlight two three hours a day preferably morning sunlight okay everyone this is it for today thank you very much for watching i'll see you in my next video bye now